First place, what is your evaluation of the Congress and what is the message that this Congress gives to the peoples of Europe? The message, the main message of this Congress is that we have to stop austerity. The current policies in Europe create pain, disappointment, unemployment, disaster in Europe. So we have to stop this procedure. We have to create a hope. We have to change Europe. And this is the message. We decide uh, our document with a large uh, majority and also we decide to have a candidacy against the low liberal candidates in the uh, European Union for, for the presidency of uh, uh, the Commission. So I think that European election is a good chance to change the balances in Europe and the European left will not be a, margin, um, uh, a marginal uh, political force but uh, we will be in, uh, uh, in the field of fight and we will give this fight uh, in favor of people, in favor of citizens, in favor of employees and of young people for the future of Europe. And what is the actions that the EL can do to take this message and the agreements of the Congress to the peoples of Europe? This is the, the, the difficult work that we have to do ahead. Uh, we have to cooperate and uh, to try to bring the message of hope and change in uh, every European country. And first of all we have to create resistance. We have to give uh, hope to the disappointed people that we could change the balances and we could win uh, the conservative uh, policies, the conservative uh, uh, political parties that divides Europe when we want to unite Europe. And last but not least, you have recently been nominated by this Congress as uh, the EL candidate to the presidency of the European Commission. Uh, what does this candidacy mean personally to you, to Syriza and to the EL? <laughs> it's a great honor. Personally for me it means that I will work more tough. <laughs> uh, but I think that it's uh, a honor also for series and Greek people because we are in the front line of a very difficult bat uh, battle. Uh, we give this battle, we give this fight. Uh, we know that uh, we are in a critical crossroad. Uh, I believe that whole Europe is, uh, is under an economic war. This war has vit victims, poor people, unemployment people, but this is not a war between nations and peoples. Uh, this is a war between labor forces, citizens and peoples, and with the forces of the financial markets. So I think that uh, uh, we'll give uh, this fight with uh, more forces united, and uh, I believe that uh, Finally, we will manage to create a very clear alternative proposal for Europe. Uh, I am very optimistic that uh, in this election, elections, EL, European left, will be the surprise. And we will try and will manage finally to change the balances.